I start these vlogs really positive and really high energy and you know if you guys are down I'm just trying to make you smile just you know lift you up a bit but um, this vlog is gonna at least the beginning of this vlog is gonna be a little bit different just I want to be a little bit more real I just want to have a quick conversation with you guys about something that's going on in my life so I have really bad eyesight and so I had a procedure and um, I had an adverse reaction to it and um, it's not that it's bad or anything, but this is the new me, and I feel like you guys will be totally fine, and you'll accept me as I am, but I just wanted to let you know that um, this is what you're dealing with, dealing with now. I did it. Ah! We're just gonna load this hose full of flour. I hate you so much. Are you ready to become a graffiti artist? Hold on, look at me. like it or like it. I just never really had uh, any like idea of what I should say in the beginning of the vlog. Not that. As you guys know, if you're like following the vlog, Katie is my niece. She has been over for the last several days. Unfortunately. We've done a lot of great fun family activities. That just um, that sounds creepy. Oh, put your back to mine. Charlie's Angels. <laughs> <laughs> I think my finger know what in your eyeball. Are you okay? So apparently today uh, we, we had multiple eye surgeries. <laughs> How are you doing? Doing fantastic. If you've been following the vlog the last several days, you know that we had we had a bird in the chimney. Are you serious? <laughs> There's definitely a bird in there. We saved that bird. We saved it. <laughs> I can't see out of this eye. This is how we should do it. So you can see me. <laughs> At this moment, we are trying to name that bird. Now, if you have a suggestion, we have a lot of great names that are just like pouring in. Three comments <laughs> is pouring in. For us, that's pouring in. So if you want to be a part of that, if you want to help us name whatever bird was in our chimney, it's a bat! Go to the last video, first link in the description. How should we introduce it? You say something. Something. Hi, um. You need to start pulling your weight here. Birdhouses. Oh yeah, let's go see how much more bomb my birdhouse is than his. You have to make it entertaining. I'm just, guys, I'm sorry. I'm trying um, to train her. Like a dog? <laughs> bad, bad, bad. I'll pee on your carpet. Let's go see how much better my birdhouse is than his. No, you have to be like, so as you guys know, like that. Okay. Let's go see. No! Oh my gosh. You can't just be like, okay, next segment, let's go see the birdhouses. You gotta be like, <laughs> you gotta be like, ow! Why are we still here? Hey, let's go see the bird. No! No, no, no! If you don't get it this one time, go. You guys are gonna go see the bird. <laughs> You're dead! I'm turning the camera off because it's about to get real. Say what we say, huh? Okay, 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 okay. Hey guys, look, so Katie, oh my gosh, it's, I feel so bad for her. So, um, tell them what happened. Um, I fell on my own self fault. I did it. So in the other vlog, we made two birdhouses and we're having an ongoing competition as the first one to get a bird that makes a nest inside of their house wins. We are at the birdhouses. We have the masterpiece. We have just the brilliancy, you know, architecturally phenomenal. But we, as of right now, we don't see any birds. We don't see no birds making any nests up in there. And we've got, I don't even know what you consider this. We got the outhouse over here. It's perfection. If I was a bird, I, that's what I would want. Hey, we have the outhouse here. Do you got any birds living up in there? It even has a thumbs up on it. I don't see any bird nests in there so far. It's like, that's hey, oh, your D's falling off. Don't say that. Don't show that. It's part of the game. This is not part of the game. Katie <laughs> is clearly just a sore loser, and she just knows I'm probably going to... I'm not. I didn't lose. I mean, you're already losing. Your house is going to probably fall apart before anything even happens. Well, who needs D anyway? Eth. It's the Eth house. Bye. What's wrong? What's wrong? Why are you so flinchy? I think I actually know why she's so flinchy. Ah, you son of a bitch! I saw it right before it happened. Flinchy. 
flinchy. I'm so flinchy. You know what? You're asking for it now. I am not. You're I asking didn't... for it. I didn't even say anything. Okay, guys. I can hear you. <laughs> Something. Watch your step! Ah! Oh, God! Dang it! So, Katie, she made a mistake. That mistake was she, she awoke in the beast inside of me that wants to prank her. And when I say I want to prank her, I'm not saying like a confetti blaster ah! or popping another balloon. Ah, you son of a I'm saying we go all out. We go intrication. It's not a word. Intrication is not a word. Ah, I just want to scream. I just want to yell. I just want to be screaming at you guys right now, but I can't because she is up there. She's transcribing or she's doing whatever she's doing on the computer, helping out the channel. God bless her. And she might not be doing it after this prank. Rather than just me explaining it, let's actually start building what we're gonna do. Okay, okay. This is going to be the plan. This is how we are going to prank Katie. We have a shop vac. It has a really big hose, a lot of suction power. You can connect the hose to the other side and it will actually blow. We're gonna get the hose. We're gonna put a funnel on it. And we're just gonna load this. We're just gonna load this hose full of flour. Right? Now, this is the hard part. How do we get Katie to hold a hose in front of her face without being suspicious? This is what we do. We're going to get a surge protector. I think I wrote surge potato. So. This is a surge protector, it has a bunch of plugs. We're going to plug an extension cord into the surge protector, run it to the shop vac. So the shop vac is on, but the surge protector is off. And we position the hose so it's going to point directly at Katie. It's so pumped right now, but I have to keep it low. If my voice sounds weird, it's because I'm like, I just wanna be like, this is awesome! But we're trying to whisper. All we need to do is come up with a backstory. We need to just figure out some reason that Katie will stand in front of the camera and we can position the hose in a certain way that will not be suspicious. Okay guys, so we are ready to do this prank. Now, two things. First thing that you just need to know that this hose has a bunch of flour that is lining the whole inside and that is connected to the shop vac, that is connected to the surge protector that I will switch on at some point with Katie right here. Now, how are we going to get Katie to get right there? We are actually going to film a skit. Now, this is the thing. Whenever I was trying to make up something for a logical reason for Katie to do this, so we're gonna film the skit, and at the end of the skit is when the prank is going to happen. <laughs> What? We're gonna use this thing. Yeah! I've always wanted to use this thing. You're not using it though. I know, not for real, but like... Oh, I swear! You're dead! Stop hitting my children! You done? Are you done with those shenanigans? Shenanigans. <laughs> okay guys, so we are about to film this skit now. We're gonna give you a quick rundown on the skit, just in the off chance that like, it turns out like crap. You don't even know. Move on. You don't even know! Move on! She don't know. Okay, so what we <laughs> she don't know <laughs> she doesn't. So what we're gonna be doing is this is a, a we're filming a skit like we're two scientists from the 1970s trying to fi trying to find the cure for the um, googly eye syndrome. Oh, you totally look like a dude from the 70s. You take the choker off. You need. You definitely need this. I could rock this. Thing. Hey, are you ready for the scientist? Are you ready? Are you ready for the set? Is this, what is this? How do we turn this thing on? Is it on? Is it on? Is it on, sir? I'm your assistant. Assistant! Are you ready to do the experiment for the googly eye syndrome? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. This is part one of the googly eye syndrome pro testing, section one. Commence the test. I feel like the, the accent you're doing is racist. Why is it racist? I don't know, I just feel like it is. Okay. Oh, googly eyes! We need dialogue! <laughs> MBS 6! I dropped it in the tube! 2 of 1 a sec! 7. Mm, 
increase quarter. Are you increasing the quarter? Yes, I'm increasing. What are you increasing? I don't know what you're saying. The quarter. What is clear? One or two? Two. Two? Okay, try three or four. Which one's darker? Three. Not sharper, but darker. Two. Okay. to become a graffiti artist? Sure. Ah! Okay, so what we have... Oh, that, hey, we should do this more often. We're gonna paint on the table. Oh, you're right. Move everything. Do you ever watch, like, those street artists that, like, get a bunch of spray paint? It's gonna be nothing like that. Yeah, it's gonna be nothing like that. But, like, they get the scrapers and they're doing, like, stuff, and then the BAM! It's like this beautiful work of just, like, art. Katie and I are gonna try that, and we're gonna try and make portraits of each other. Um, will it work? No. Quite honestly, I'm pretty excited to try it myself. Don't you freaking dare. This is gonna be hard. In my brain, I was like, this is gonna be fun! And now I'm like, how do we do this? All right, we'll make your face, so your face is gonna be like, here. I have a very angular jaw, excuse you. Jocks? Jocks. I think I'm gonna paint you, oh, hold on, like this. Can I have a shirt that you don't care about? Hold up, high have... five. One, two... No, I don't want to high five you. Yeah, guess what guys? Your different clothes on. I got the same underwear on. We're not gonna address the Batman here. I'm Batman. Classic Batman. Oh, I already did it. Those are my scars on my face. I just have to work that in. It's gonna be around the cheekbones, so. <laughs> my hands are sweating so much. Mm. Um, face. We didn't think about this beforehand. This is gonna be bad. Oh, this is gonna be bad. I'm just getting a face palette. Because in my life, we spray paint in an enclosed area. 
your smiling teeth. That feels still a little out of whack. At this point, I might be messing this up even worse. Uh, I think you are. Well, this is the thing. I had it perfect. So you're unsatisfied. It was perfect. Now you're unsatisfied. Now I just all I see is an 80s rocking clown. So, this is Katie, obviously. <laughs> Dog, I mean like, do I really gotta explain that one? So, um, this is back in Katie when she, uh, last year she went through this phase where she like dressed up like a clown and um, she was totally into like hair metal. I'm gonna leave a link to my email. Any street artists who want mentored by me, I'll free, it'll be free, free of charge. Katie, um, how will you walk the fine folks at home through whatever this vomit pile is? Yeah, I don't really need to hype mine up because it speaks for itself. Silence. Did you hear that? It spoke. <laughs> so what we need you guys to do, we need your help. We need you to vote. Who did better, Ben or Katie? Write in the comments who won the, uh, I mean, I mean, just, it's spelled B-E-N. Just, you know, just throw it in right now.